Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with the free pick in the Blue Jays versus Guardians Major League Baseball matchup on Sunday, June 16, 2024. If you like all the free picks we do at PickDogs, you'll love our premium picks, our best bets. Use the discount code PICK, you'll get 15% off. We also have products meant for people that make larger bets, people with bigger bankrolls looking for VIP style service. The, these type of products are not available under the premium picks tab at our website. They're also a little more expensive than those picks, but if they fit your bankroll and budget, by all means, text that number they are worth it but let's get to it it's the blue jays taking on the guardians jose barrios on the mound for the jays it's ben lively on the mound for the guardians you know the blue jays continue to muck around and when you look at the standings in the american league east and they sit in second to last place at this point but they are way off the pace with the orioles and yankees pretty much running away with it but when you change over and look at the wild card race really three and a half games back so still within arm's reach is that a good thing or a bad thing? It's kind of tough to say because I don't think the Blue Jays have a team that can contend, but at the same time, they're within reach of the playoffs. So at what point do they cut bait and think, eh, maybe we're better off trading some of these players since we can't win now and build for the future? Jose Barrios has been pretty solid this season. He's not perfect, that's for sure. Last time out giving up three runs. He's given up three runs and two runs and eight runs even so far this inning. But overall, the body of work, 2.93 ERA. He's got one complete game out there as well. He's pitched, he's given up 73 hits over 86 innings, 64 strikeouts, just 13, well, 13 home runs is actually a little to the high side, and uh, 22 walks. But, uh, you know, like I said, that 2.93 ERA, he has played well enough. On the other side of it, Ben Lively for the Guardians. Here's a guy who's resurrecting his career. I mean, this guy was absolutely terrible last season with a 5.38 ERA in Cincinnati. He goes over here to Cleveland, checks in with a 2.59 ERA, allowing just 47 hits through 55 and two-thirds innings of work. He's walked 15 batters, and he's given up seven home runs. He struck out 48. He has just been solid. I mean, there's really no other way to describe it. He has just been very solid across the board, as the Guardians have as well. As the Guardians lead that American League Central division, and you know they lead it pretty pretty well with a nice five-game lead over the Kansas City Royals. But a lot of the the distance um, that they have against the Royals is in the loss column. So their lead in the loss column is actually bigger than their overall leads. It's more in the seven range. So the Guardians sitting in very very good shape, and at the halfway point in the season, or as we approach the halfway point of the season about a dozen games away from that. You know, I just like the way the Guardians have been playing overall. Um, you know, not perfect, but to just continue to frustrate teams. On the road, not nearly as good as they've been at home, but at the same time, they've played a, a very road-centered um, schedule. Meanwhile, the Blue Jays played have played most of their games on the road as well, but they're, you know, just around a 500 home team. I don't see much of an edge in that one. I think the Guardians are the better team, and I think Lively and Barrios probably canceled themselves out as far as the pitching matchup goes. I'm going to take the uh, Guardians, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.